Hey guys, I just wanted to let you guys know that I did purchase a lipstick from Milk Cosmetic called By Starlight. As you can see, it is on my lip. There is a tutorial on this look. It will come out after this video, probably like two to three days afterwards. You know, keep you guys anticipating something. <laughs> well, as you can see, um, in the next clip, I'm going to show the application of this lipstick um, called By Starlight by Melt Cosmetics. Now, for those of you who did not see my DGAF video, I'm going to link it right over here so that you can click on it and see what my initial review of the lipstick was that first day. Today is the first day that I actually placed this on my lip and I have to say that the formulation does differ from DGAF. DGAF is more smooth of an application. Um, it even though it does have a matte finish, it's like a shinier matte finish. While this one is reminiscent of Ruby Woo or probably even uh, Riri Woo, the retro matte from uh, Matte Cosmetics. To give you guys a good guesstimate and a feel for the formulation of this particular lipstick. I actually did just receive my... Um, bang bang <laughs> in the mail today so there will be a review for that one as well i haven't gotten the chance to play with it touch it see exactly how it is that i like it but as of right now so far so good i really like the fact that it is a true matte purple color it has a blue based undertone which gives the you know appearance of whiter teeth even though my teeth are a little white they're not as white as these lipsticks are making them out to be. <laughs> well, guys, um, I'm also going to leave down all the information as to how much it was, shipping and handling, so on and so forth, and how long it took for my items to actually reach here. Um, I think that's, yeah, I think that's about it. Well, if you guys have any requests for anything, leave a comment down below and let me know what it is that you want to see, and I'll be sure to get back to you, okay? Bye, guys.